Hey guys, welcome to week 12 of 52 and hashtag Realtor Life. And I wanted to talk to you this week about being intoxicated and the intoxication that's happening right now with buyers and sellers. I think sellers are probably a little more intoxicated. Um, and then buyers are intoxicated in a different way. So intoxicating to be so popular, right? And I think that um, I've been watching a lot of forums and masterminds about agents being asked to cut their commissions because the house sold so quickly and they didn't have to work so hard. It's a really, really loaded statement because, you know, if you're selling a house, that's one thing, but if you're buying a house on the other side of the buy, you're writing 10, 12, sometimes 15 offers to get one of those offers accepted. So I think it's an interesting conversation that is starting to pop up that sellers are saying to agents right now, well, you didn't have to work that hard, so we think you should cut your commission. Well, first of all, the broker that we work for owns our deal, so we don't own them. Um, there's not necessarily a set commission. There's a guideline for Arizona that most of us do follow. Um, there are times that we do give discounts, and often I will reserve a piece of that for um, a negotiation piece. If, if let's say a deal is going to fall apart for something really, really important, and I'm at a standstill, I like to hold on to some of those pieces if, in fact, I have to contribute. But what I want to make sure you guys are really, really clear about is if you are that buyer and you're like, well, I think you should discount your rate. It's easy, I've talked about it before, it's easy to look at the settlement statement and see a total of, let's say, 6%. You think that that agent, me, is getting the whole 6%. We're not. You guys, we're getting 3%, basically, gross. That's before we pay our marketing, our taxes, our fees. Um, we basically work for free until your house is sold and done. So while it's tempting to ask your agent for a discount, especially now when you feel that they're not working that hard for you, I think there's a lot of under the surface work that goes into selling a home and buying a home. Um, and just listen, the market is dictating the fact that houses are moving quickly. You know, So you wouldn't go to the grocery store and say, well, gee, you're selling a lot of eggs, so you may as well give me a discount, right? would never never do that and I'm sure at your business you probably wouldn't want someone to do the same to you so um, just as always I like to try to bring you guys little things that I'm hearing about in the market hearing about in my masterminds and from other top agents in the industry um, so I hope you'll keep me in mind if you're looking to buy or sell if you hear of anybody looking to buy or sell please send them my way I'll take great care of them and I will talk to you guys next week for week 13 of 52 and hashtag Realtor Life